I wanted to finally use the spinner properly. So I decided that I would do a pour into a strainer. But instead of using a strainer, I'm using, I believe this is something that, um, this is the container which the pushpins came in. If it wasn't the pushpins, it might have been one of the things that the kids got for school, or some part of their stationery, I don't know. Um, something that some sort of, uh, you know, something like most likely i think the pushments that came in so i'm using this con uh, this container the small one it has holes in it and i thought let me try this and see what kind of a design it makes um, i'm using an 8 by 10 canvas the exact paint colors are listed in the description box below um, but in general i think i use mostly like uh, red pinks and blue type colors um, but um, like i said the colors will be listed below um, and uh, I really enjoyed doing this I hope you wa like watching it and uh, let's see how it turns out So this is a close-up of how the paint is looking coming out of the container. It looks so cool. And the design in the middle is reminding me of this picture I saw once. Um, the silhouette of a head of a, I think they're called mystical dancers. And they have this hat that's long. So it looks like one of those, um, it looks so much like that. It's so satisfying to see when the paint is coming out and oozing out of those little holes there and uh, the designs and the colors, how they're mixing and everything. Um, it's just so satisfying to do and it's so satisfying to watch also. Well, guess what? Yep, I forgot to turn on the record button again. Surprise? No, I'm not surprised, but I am so bummed out. But anyway, the good thing is that I'm not done. I am going to continue to pour more onto this um, 
I wanted to, I wasn't sure what, I wasn't really that satisfied with it. And so I decided I want to do it one more time. And so you're going to get to see the second half anyway. Now as I'm going to spin and you enjoy how the paint moves while I am spin um, the spinner, um, the results may at first seem rather plain, but just hold on. See how it develops. Uh, there will be so much development into this, um, into this painting. So be sure to watch till the end to see the... Um, close-ups and the mock-up of how it may look. So as you can see, the cell development as it comes in, it's gradual, but it's absolutely stunning. It's it's so beautiful and I'm just blown away by it. Let me know what you think about it. And I want to request that if you like this video, please like it, please share it, please subscribe to my channel. It really uh, motivates me and it helps my channel grow. Please also check out my Facebook and my Instagram. I also have a Twitter. The links are in the box below as well. And I really want to thank you for watching. I hope you continue to watch. I hope you take care of yourself. Keep safe and may you always be blessed. Until next time, thank you.